Uh, Dave, you've got Hunter Fiducia out there. I know it's not his major league debut to the season that pinch hit, but how special is it for a young player to be getting his first career start and doing it here at Dodger Stadium? I'm excited. Um, it's going to be, obviously, it's a thrill for him. Um, I, I like the way that he's caught Gavin uh, a ton, knows them, their familiarity there. Um, and also, I just feel that given Will and off day, uh, day game after night game makes sense. So, I'm excited to see what Hunter can do. He had a really strong spring training. What did you learn about him that prepared him for this year? I, I think the thing with Hunter is, He's uh, from the South. Uh, it's a slow brain heartbeat. Um, so in the box, he's very calm. I don't think this moment's going to be too big for him. Um, and the guys like him. So I think that for me, it's somebody I trust. He's been in the organization a long time. Understands what we do as an organization, as a pitching staff. And like I said, I feel good about uh, the battery today. We didn't get to talk about it yesterday, but Shohei Otani threw off the mound for the first time since having surgery. How big of a step is that? And what? how encouraging is that just for him? I know we talked about this way for this year, but looking ahead to next year. It's a big step for Shohei, I think, for, for the confidence to be able to get off the mound, um, to throw some different pitches. Um, I, I, the, the rehab has been great. He's put in a lot of uh, hard work. The, the staff has put in a lot of hard work. And yeah, like you said, that I don't think it really impacts this year, but it's still continuing to build a foundation for him for 20 months. Is the plan still like that for us at the point where he's facing hitters and they kind of like shut him down from that point on? Like, yeah, that's still the plan. Yeah. When's the next time he's supposed to uh, take the mound, you know? Um, I would say a week, uh, you know, give or take a couple days. Tony Goslin said that he's not really sure his 2024 is over yet, but he's been growing, obviously, he was like, how open is that door for him possibly being I think it should, it's slightly open, and I think that's a good mindset for Tony um, to kind of shoot for something this year. And um, if all things line up, great. Um, and, and if it doesn't, then we can pivot to 25. But I think that his mindset that the door is not completely closed on 24 is a good thing. Where, where could he help you? Was that, where could he help you? More as a starter? Or a no, it would be out of the pen. Um, just looking at the calendar, the build up. Um, he's pitched out of the pen. Um, so that's where it would be potentially if it could happen. Did you see something in him today that leads you to believe? Anyway, you know, whether he could do it or you know, a long shot. Well, I, I think that I was talking to Ron Porterfield, who's kind of man of the rehab. Um, the command has gotten a lot better. Uh, the fastball, he's, he's touch, he's 92 to 94. So you'd expect an uptick in velocity. He's using all of his pitches. Um, so all that stuff lines up with kind of some optimism. Did you remember Ryan um, have the surgery yet? He did. Okay. He's uh, back home in North Carolina visiting his uh, son. But he'll be back, I think, next week. Everything went well. Everything went great. Is Bruce out his bullpen? What's that? Is Bruce out his bullpen? Um, he threw a bullpen yesterday. Uh, he is going to go on rehab next week. And so, you know, I'm still counting on him. Um, another side note is uh, we flipped uh, Flaherty and uh, Walker. So Flaherty's going to go on Tuesday. Walker will go on Wednesday, and just to give Walker an extra day. Maybe I'd go back to the A's and Phillips in the ninth. You have a lot of guys that have closed games this year, but you have a preference. Would you like to get Phillips back up to speed in that spot? You know, I, I would just, I, I want Evan to just keep having confidence, keep pitching well. You know, yesterday it was unique in the sense that they hit for guys at the bottom. And I liked, uh, if they did hit, I liked uh, Kopech versus some potential left-handers. And there's a clear righty run in the ninth. And so it just didn't work out. But, uh, you know, if I had to do it over again, I would do the same thing. But, yeah, I think in a perfect world, um, you know, I would have Evan, Kopi, and then um, Huddy, who I feel needed a little bit of a reset. So we've tried to stay away from him. He's available today. Um, I wanted to give him a few days, just kind of not in a game, and get him back would be ideal. Was that a physical thing with him or more? No, or just more? both. I mean, I just think that he's thrown more innings than he's thrown since 2019. So he's been, you know, started the season with us going wire to wire. So, you know, certain guys have had blows. And, and uh, so now for Huddy to be able to kind of play the slice, um, that's what I was trying, I'm trying to do. Back to Shohei, how did he say he felt after uh, throwing yesterday? Felt good. Shohei felt good. So it's been 
not surprisingly, it's been uh, very encouraging this whole process. He's not gonna. He's not gonna let on how he's feeling. I, I do know that throwing is, is uh, more difficult than hitting, and um, you know there was even a play yesterday where he typically would have got the lead runner at second base, but I think that he was a little mindful of the finger, so he took it out at first. But um, having him in the lineup is still huge. He's going to go to Round Rock. Uh, that's our AAA, uh, AAA with OKC. He's going to be pitching on the road on Wednesday. So he'll throw a bullpen on Monday, and then Wednesday he'll uh, head out. You got Chris Taylor back in the lineup playing a second today. What are you hoping to see from him to put this return? Um, I just want to see good at bats. Uh, I, I think that... Uh, yeah, I just want to see good at bats. And I think that before he got hurt, uh, he was trending, he was swinging the bat well. And so I think now I just want to see him have competitive at bats.